In this video, I will show you how easy it is to measure a distance. Find the volume and area by using this total laser distance detector. Aside from measuring a distance, this device can also automatically add or subtract multiple distances, calculates areas and volumes, and many more. This device is very handy, especially when you are measuring a height of a structure as you don't have to climb up on top to do it. So here are the important specs. It can measure a distance from 0.2 to 40 meters with measuring accuracy of plus minus 2 mm. It has a class 2 laser. Operating uh, temperature is from 0 to 40 degrees centigrade. Storage temperature is from minus 20 to positive 65 degrees centigrade. It is splash proof and dust protected. So it comes with the pouch. As you can see how uh, nice the design is. Rigid construction with a spirit level. And here's the back part. Let's check the battery. Which is a double A battery. Any uh, double A battery will do. With specs at the back. It's the bottom part with a uh, bottom extension. We will discuss later what is the use of this one. And there's the laser part. Okay, you can see the laser there, class two. Don't uh, point it in your eye or to an eye of anyone around. So this is the uh, function button where you can uh, select distance, mode, area, volume, height, etc. In a unit button, you can uh, select meter, feet, ins or region. Okay, one press will change it to feet, as you can see. Then one more to change it to inch. Okay, it's inch now, and uh, another one to change it to region. All right. In the plus minus button, a short press will add or subtract multiple distances up to 12, while a long press will lift up the display readout of the unit. You will see it later in this video. Keep on watching! Now we are going to check the accuracy of this laser distance detector by comparing it to a 305 mm roller. Okay. The unit bolt on here has two options. A long press will change the unit of measurement from meter, feet, inches, or region, while a short press will able to select the reference point of measurement. Okay, so now it's the uh, bottom part, the reference point, okay, it's the bottom, the zero should start from the bottom, okay, now we press again, the bottom extension is the reference point, 
Another press will be the top of the unit or detector is the reference point. Okay? So now we are going to use a uh, roller to do that. So this is a three from zero to the end of the roller is 305 mm. So remember that our laser has a uh, plus minus 2 ac mm accuracy. So now it is set from the top. So we align the top to zero in the, in the uh, roller. Okay, it's zero. We align it there. And press the red button. Then press again to measure. All right, it's uh, 304 mm or 0.304 meters. It's a uh, 1 mm difference, okay? So in half time, it depends how you place the detector to the roller. <laughs> okay, so we'll try. Now from the bottom, align to zero. Bottom align to zero. Press to bring out the laser and press again to measure. Okay, it's now 306 mm. Okay, so we'll see. We are going to use now the uh, bottom extension. Okay. Aligning it to zero on the roller to so press on the red button and you see it's 305 mm or 0 0.305 all right you guys can also uh, add distances up to 12 12 distances okay how we're going to do that? Because you first measure the first distance. Then, one more press. Then you click this button one time so that the flash will appear. Let's say, what? There's another distance. These are out. It's 0.824 now. You want to add again this another distance okay then two clicks it's 1.2 now you add another one okay you want to add another one you move a little bit so on and so forth until uh, 12 distances you know, maximum all right so that is the plus function the same goes with the minus function okay minus function you want to subtract the distances for example you have this distance Point six one. So double click until the minus sign appears. Then press again. Okay. Another one.
subtract up to 12 numbers you can do it so while subtracting you can also add you know just press one time okay so that's it plus minus function of the laser gas detector guys can also find distance certain distance from a certain point okay for example we want to uh, find the point four point four from the wall or 400 mm you press the power then long press okay it will uh, this the upper number is the present distance so you want to move to point four you just push the uh, device closer to the wall until you got that stable point four rating okay a little bit more right now you have the point four ready oops Now I will show you how to measure area. Okay, we uh, select the bottom as reference point. Right, so it's uh, bottom now as the reference point. Then we click the function button until the area function appears. That's the area function there, flashing. Now let us measure the length. So make sure that the laser is uh, pointing towards the other wall. So the length is 0 0.606 meters. Now we measure the width. is 0.555 and the uh, area 0.336 appears 0.336 square meter so it's very easy to do this lastly let me show you how to measure volume so we will measure volume of this refrigerator so click function until the volume function appears so that's the volume function a cube okay then uh, we measure the length width and the height okay so we measure the length first doesn't matter which one are you going to measure first as long as the three sides are measured Say it is the length. Okay. The length is 0.458 meters. 0.458 meters. Then we measure the width from the bottom.
So the width is 0.452 meters. Now, the height. Okay, the height. So the height is 0.686 and we have the uh, volume of 0.142 cubic meters. Click the uh, function, the unit button to change it to feet. Okay. It's 5 cubic feet refrigerator. All right. If you like this video, please, please give it a thumbs up and click the subscribe button. Thank you so much.